So I kind of have my layout here. I'm going to follow this line straight across and then I'm going to start stepping down right here. And it's going to be one, two, three. Then it's going to step down. Then it's going to be one, two. Then it's going to step down. Then it's going to be one. Step down. One, two, three. Step down. Then one, two. Step down. Then one. Step down. Then one, two, three and so on and so forth, all the way across, so that it's going to be on a diagonal going this way, and these are going to also be in a diagonal going that way, and that'll help to correct for some of the oddities in the floor. There's a little oddity here, a little teeter-totter here. There's one right here, so i got to build up some compound here, and hopefully I can correct it. seems to be like a bend in the floor or something I don't know but uh, that's what I plan on doing today I only have three boxes of tile so that's 16 tiles in each box that's 30 uh, 48 tiles plus these um, I don't know how many that it is one two three four five uh, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. It is weird though, because it's like I need to do these to make sure. I can't start them going this way and then that way and run out of tile. I have to like finish because when this mortar dries, you can pull the tiles in particular directions. And I can't block them all off by screwing in wood. It's not practical. <sighs> so I have to determine how many tiles I actually need now. I'm pretty sure I need about six more boxes. <laughs> 